strange objects orbiting a black hole in the center Milky Way. Astronomers have found six strange objects orbiting in near the supermassive black holes at the center of our galaxy. They look like big clouds of gas and dust, but they behave like stars. These objects do not they resemble nothing that has been observed in the Milky Way so far. They're so peculiar, that researchers created a completely new class of G-type objects for them. At a distance of 0.2 light years from supermassive black Sagittarius holes A asterisk, which is located in the center of the Milky Way, six strange objects are opposed to the monster's gravity. They look like clouds gas and dust, but they behave like stars. Astronomers don't know what exactly are. Researchers at the University of California, Los Angeles, UCLA, the who are studying a new class of strange objects, reported their discoveries in the magazine Nature. The first object of this type, G1, was identified in 2005 year. In 2012, a group of German astronomers found a second one, later named G2 which approached the supermassive black hole in 2014. For several years of research, scientists gradually learned about their peculiar nature and were surprised that both objects look like gigantic clouds of gas and dust with a diameter of 100 astronomical units. One hole is approximately 150 millions of kilometers distance that divides the Earth from the Sun. Initially, Astronomers thought they were ordinary clouds of gases and dust that would soon be absorbed by the black hole. But instead of staying sucked in by Sagittarius A asterisk, they continued to revolve around him. These objects look compact most of the time and have roughly spherical forms. However, as their orbits approach the black hole, they stretch like bubble gum. These objects look like gas, but they retain like stars, said Andrea Gez of UCLA. CEO author of the study. Gez and her colleagues have been studying the galactic center for over 20 years years. Along with Anna Sire Lowe, also of UCLA, they identified another four such objects, G3, G4, G5 and G6. Objects have very different orbits. Their period's orbital ranges from 170 to 1600 years. It's not entirely clear what they are. Now they emit too much heat, and researchers have noticed signatures of hydrogen atoms in them. Scholars believe that they may be stars hiding behind gas and dust shields thick enough to obscure their light. Object G2, having the tightest orbit, it's probably a binary star system that it merged into one big star. At the time of its closest approach, G2 had really weird look Gez said. We've seen it before, but it didn't look like much, peculiarly until the object approached the black hole and lengthened, the and much of his gas was torn. With this close approach and it has lost its outer shell and now becomes a more compact object again Gez explained. Something had to hold object G2 compact and enable it to survive the encounter with the black hole, Sire Lo noted, we now have a whole population of G objects, so it's not about explanation of the one-time event added. Scientists suggest that G objects may be the result of chaotic stellar collisions in which two stars merge into one large star. When this happens, a huge cloud of dust and gas is created, surrounding the new one a star for a very long time, even up to a million years after the collision. Most the stars at the center of the galaxy are very massive. In addition, most are arrangements the dual but extreme gravitational forces occurring around SGRI asterisk can enough to destabilize their orbits. While G1 and G2 have similar orbits, objects G3, G4, G5 and G6 orbit around the black hole in different ways. Gez thinks all six objects used to be binary stars, star mergers can happen in the universe more often than we expected and they are probably quite common, Gez said. Black holes can lead binary star systems to connecting. It's possible that there are many stars we've observed and haven't we understand, it may be the final product of a merger. We are just learning how they form galaxies and black holes. The way binary stars interact with a black hole is very different from how individual stars interact with with other single stars and a black hole, added Gez. The center of the galaxy is an extreme environment. Earth it is located in the suburbs compared to the center, which is located in distances approximately 26,000 light years. The 
the center of our galaxy has a density of stars a billion times larger than our part of the galaxy. The force of gravity is so much stronger. Magnetic fields are more extreme. There is extreme their astrophysics noted guess. Researchers are in the process of taking subsequent measurements which, they hope to help them find out where these strange objects come from. It seems that G objects have a lot in common, no matter what what are they. Further research will provide more information and may succeed solve puzzle. The surroundings of the supermassive black one need to be further observed holes in the center of the Milky Way to see what happens next.